Look around at all our faces. For a week we've lived in both and place. All of us from many different places. Now all we want to do is stay. Cali, Calas. Well, the place found me rather than I find a place. Now I, I've been out here for 10 years. I know that it's the region where Chiron, the wounded healer, was. And it was an ancient healing area 2,000 years ago. They were, they were doing dream analysis and fasting here. It's a beautiful, beautiful area and has, it's green. We have plenty of water and the soil is very fertile. And I used to go on vacation myself in Mexico, Ibiza, Greece. Because of the nature of the being that I am, I was uh, dissatisfied, bored, really, after a few days. And uh, I wanted something more meaningful. And that's what I found at Skiros. That was a meaningful holiday. They were running workshops, and at the same time, you had a wonderful holiday. So I thought, that's a great concept. I would like to combine that holiday and uh, educational experience uh, with community building, all three together. You've got to give equal priority to the educational aspect, the workshop or the retreat. I'm very keen on my community building, so I won't give up my time with community building. So basically, the day divides up in the morning from the time the buffet breakfast is over, say from 9.30, and then we get that cleaned up, from 9.30 until 1.30 with a coffee break. That's usually workshop time. The energy of the green rivers getting alive, and you know, and I feel them walking around the circle. And then... People either take a picnic lunch down to the beach or they stay up here and eat with the staff. People are on the beach from 2.30 until about a quarter to six, and that's their beach time. You cannot get people not to have their beach time when they come here. The beaches are fabulous out here. And then in the evening, people are coming back by six o'clock, 6.15. They are working in the garden, and we have uh, 1,300 square meters, I believe. So we have some vegetable gardens here. We have lots of flower beds. And we, of course, cook the evening meal, which is the main meal, so we do that together. It's going to be tzatziki. It's a very typical dressing and sauce using grease. We have this very small little hotel or large guest house, which has nine rooms, but two of the rooms are not really usable. One is the workshop and the other is the office. We are now renting rooms across the street at the, Mr. Dimitri's house. We're renovating those so that they are more attractive to Westerners. The magic here is something I imported from Findhorn. And the thing that makes it work out here are the circles. We uh, have this stick and it gives us the power of speech, and the rest of us have the power to be listeners, which is not so easy. Anything that you want to share with the others, the rest of us, to get to know each other a little better. Um, Sean, I also live in London, and I'm here because I'm not doing anything for myself at the moment, and I don't really know what I want to do in the future. So I'm a bit in between with things. And yeah, I'm very fortunate to come here. I'm glad I did. We are very determined that yes, we are going all the family together, one week in Greece. And, and then she said, you know what, if it's the place that they shot Mamma Mia, maybe I will come with you. <laughs> Uh, if you look around you, um, much of these seeds were planted by these hands. And it's fantastic to see the circle of sunflowers supporting this, this circle of 
timber supporting this circle of sky that with many, many, many other hands we put together and we lifted and we raised. So I was here for the, the, the work camp. And, you, and I have friends in America and Canada who they say it's not possible to build a community of people coming and going. But uh, those of you who've been here see that it is possible. Some, and, and it's possible because of these circles. It's the circles that, that does it. I'm sure of it. That, in a way, that's what it's about. And um, the kind of community that we build, people think, oh, we're going to a community. Actually, you haven't come to a community. You are making, you are making this community. And it changes um, every single week, I think. The, the energy changes, the people change, the vision changes, <laughs> the community changes, everything changes. Which is very, can be very challenging. But it's also wonderful. You gotta throw them to greet and say goodbye to the people that are leaving. So they will have this image in their minds.